about the habitat Okay, habitat of uh, stingless bee uh, <coughs> So basically they, they, they live in cavities uh, In uh, holes basically Okay So this, this is some of the uh, common or the spot where the stingless bee were found This is the most commonly in the branches uh, of trees so it happened right, like 100 feet or 30 feet, very high. So um, ranchers or who people who, who who collect them from the uh, while uh, they have train train ice lah. They have to spot the stingless bee. Um, maybe maybe if you are lucky, you can spot it yourself. Mm. I have spot that in some places in the UTM. Okay, of course, uh, uh, we do not okay uh, cut all the tree that we've spot. <laughs> okay, you cannot do that. They do do they they, they do live in dead logs. Okay, they all do found in abandoned termite hills. Okay, even in buildings and other in like unusual places, nah. Okay, like this place. Yeah, they, they inside the poles, okay, poles, uh, like uh, shelter poles, so okay, parking garage, okay, in the bamboo, okay, they also found, uh, but they don't have the capability to make the holes, and then they just come, okay, how they pick, only God know how they pick, but. Uh, the I also uh, practice la, like uh, making uh, empty box we call bed box uh, we put some propolis inside such cannot don't be too big and then I hang it somewhere if I'm lucky they will come they for me new swimming swimming uh, uh, usually happen during the dry season dry season uh, like in Malaysia dry season maybe in January to uh, June normally but now because of the climate change I think it's uh, hard to notice when it's the dry season very difficult but anyway I do uh, like, like the, the swarming that I shown you that happened in March right? the swarming into the empty box happened in March other like uh, <laughs> like in cannons cannon also, it is a dead log. Okay. So these are the structure. Okay, the structure. Okay, you can see the structure. There are a few uh, important mm, uh, uh, things that you need to know from the structure. So this is the basically the structure, the common structure. Okay, the most important one is the entrance. Okay, the the only one entrance. Singless be only one entrance. If you make another hole there or here, here, they will seal it. It's, it's, it's their defense mechanism. There will be no multiple uh, entrance. There could be multiple uh, uh, entrance, there could be multiple holes on the entrance, but it's just on the entrance. Okay? okay. The entrance looks like a funnel, uh, it's like a tube. It's a tube which is uh, direct into the broad, brood, sorry, brood, brood cell chamber, uh, tower or chamber. This is the main. Okay. Direct main. Okay, they, so basically, they are the passageway or the entrance, the brood section. Okay, the brood section. The storage section. Storage section, okay, top and bottom. The f where they uh, put the food, food, uh, the honey, the nectar, eh, sorry, the honey and the uh, bee bread or the pollen, okay. And then the some open spaces lah, open spaces, okay. Uh, and then the nest volume section, okay. So uh, the passageway, okay. This is an extension of the entrance, okay, link to the outside, okay. So uh, a, uh, it, it looks like this because it is a defense mechanism. Okay, all the soldier okay will uh, uh, be here. 
Okay. When uh, the in the intrusion, any intruder come, so all the soldier will try to defend. Okay, we come out. Okay. Uh, <coughs> Uh, and then they have the brood cell, so they, they, they are the cerumen. Cerumen is the propolis, lah, basically. But uh, different uh, cerumen is much harder. Uh, it's much harder and brittle. Uh, but uh, propolis is much uh, rubbery. Okay, but same material, lah. Cerumen so basically they uh, they use okay as a uh, uh, layer. On the top and the bottom is hard, hard layer, okay, as a like a seal on the top and 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 and, and the bottom, okay, um, and so as you can see, the brood cell, there are multiple layers, oh layers of brood cells, okay, brood cell, and then they look like a disc. Okay, layers of disc of brood cells. Okay, and each section or each layer have a, dif a different age. Okay, so like for example, this one will hatch. Okay, the, okay, means that the next one will hatch is the. Well, maybe this one. Uh, or the ne or the next this one. Uh, okay. So the it has a different uh, age, uh, the brood the brood layers. So the queen will okay continuously lay the eggs on the empty spaces of the brood section. Okay. So the brood cell are horizontal lah, horizontal. Uh, for most of the stingless bee, horizontal. Okay. Uh, but some species, some species is uh, the brussel is vertical, but no, but the, uh, the stingless bee is horizontal, and the orientation is very important. I mean orientation, like if this is the entrance, okay, means that uh, the pupa or larva inside the brussel, the head is on the top. So in in the cell, uh, already contain some of the uh, royal jelly food for the larva. Okay, if like, for for example, if they they fall down, it may drown the pupa. Okay, that's why that is very important during transferring. You need to know the orientation. But normally, single B will uh, correct. They will correct, but depend on the number of the. Uh, workers, you have to help. You have to understand before you move. You have to mark which side is up, which side is down. If you put it wrongly, maybe half of it will drown. The 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 uh, the new cell will drown. Okay. What is the function of the button? This one. Yeah. Is to seal, okay. seal on the top and the bottom lah. They they live with other other insect like the mites. Uh, some some ants, they live together lah. They like uh, they assimilate. Mean they depend on each other. Some some ants, but some ants are very uh, a pest or, uh, or or like to you know attack the hive. That's why they have this betumen. As a seal, is 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 this bitumen is much thicker and harder, so it's it's when over the time it will become hard, as hard as a, as a rock. It's just like a wall. Yeah. yeah, it's like a cement. Some 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 species can be as hard as a as a wall. Okay, this bitumen. Okay. But uh, <coughs> let but when we when we keep the honey, okay. So we I think this the explanation, okay. So this is a uh, uh, the one that we uh, transferred, okay. Transferred from the old 
uh, wood hive uh, to, to a new hive okay as you can see the layers okay it's up to like 20 layers uh, up to 20 layers uh, this is what it looks like from the top it's like a disc okay there are basically layers okay or uh, so uh, maybe you see uh, uh, this one uh, is the workers and the drone you know the, the, you see this is the big one big big cell as a queen cell okay the queen cell can be on, on as normally you know, on the top on the top of the or somewhere on the sides okay that's the queen cells okay 